Hungry Kid Island. Hungry Kid Island. Let's show you the picture. Hungry Kid Island. I Oh, I'm going to Hungry Kid Island way, way out in the Shimmerin' Sea. There's probably hungry kids out there who'll share their lunch with me. But why call it Hungry Kid Island? There's no kids around that I see. So I'm going to Hungry Kid Island to solve this mystery. Hungry Kid Island is actually the top of a guy's head. The island is the top of a guy's head. Stork Story. Stork Story, page 166. Stork Story. You know the stork brings babies, but did you know he comes and gets the older folks when it's their time to go? Zoom right down and scoops them up, then flaps back out the door and flies them to the factory where they're all made before. And there, and there, and there their skin is tightened up, their muscles all are toned, their wrinkles are all ironed out. They're given brand new bones. Old bent backs and straight are straightened up. Now teeth are added too. Tired hearts are all repaired and made work made for uh, and made to work like new. Their memories are all removed. They they're and they're shrunk down, and then the stork flies them back down to earth as newborn, as newborn babies again. Close, not quite. The stork story should be the stork story in the resurrection, because we are rebuilt and remodified and fixed and healed, and once again receive back our perfect frames and our perfect bodies in the resurrection, because of the atonement and the resurrection of the life of Christ, and the life. Uh, and the mission of Christ. Okay, that's it for that one's falling up with Shel Silverstein.